All right, we're live. Welcome to Neil and Jay's podcast. This is episode two with my with my guest, Jim Wall. Jim. Hello, I'm Jim. That's my life now. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. I got Jim, Jay, and Neil. We are both gonna we're gonna communicate as one from now on. <laughs> we are a unit. We are right. back. We are one. Now it is you are Neil and Jim J podcast, and we must we must uh, must stick together. From now yeah, on. we we are Genom. Genom, Genom. I don't know. <laughs> oh yeah. yes, sir. So, uh, how are you guys, bro? How are you, Jay? Terrible. How about you, Jim? Uh, I'm, I'm awake. Yeah. 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 Same here, bro. Been awake since last night. Hey, what a coincidence! <laughs> <laughs> all right, so, folks. Uh, how yeah. y'all been? I'm all right. Uh, yeah, I'm fine. Yeah. Hi, right, Jim. Uh, now's your time to ask how we've been. Oh uh, yeah, no, yeah. How, how have you been? I've been good. I'm alright. That's good. Um, just, just, start? Yeah, just one question. Like, how 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 does this podcast like usually go? Like, what's the formula? Is there any formula, or is it just? So uh... you see, Jim. Um, okay. Funny you say that. <laughs> yeah. Funny you say <laughs> that. Uh, <laughs> usually, uh, we just kind of fucking talk about anything. It oh, okay. usually ends up being something really stupid. Yeah. Um, but I was trying to bring more, uh, you know, co- like yeah. some more of like a cohesive factor to it, more of a formula, right? Some to follow. Yeah. Um, unfortunately, though, you came here early and we still haven't figured that out. So yeah. we're going to go with the old stuff. We're just going to figure it out as we go. Yeah. Play so, play I, so I have a- so I, if I come back five years later, like, can I safely say we go way back? <laughs> oh, are you going to be yeah, a friend of the show when we're millionaires from this thing? You know? <laughs> but we're totally committing our entire lives to for the next yeah. five years. Yeah. When you can uh, finally, when you can finally say Jay and Neil instead of Jay featuring you. <laughs> exactly. Whenever I, 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 I find Neil uh, professional enough. To make him a full, full, full time part of the podcast. <laughs> so you could comfortably say he's your partner, yeah. Yeah. At the moment, he is a tool for the success of the podcast. <laughs> I thought you were gonna say slave. <laughs> Not for real, though. We are business partners yeah. of the highest caliber. <laughs> We've, I mean, you know, you know how hard it is to come up with the concept of. Having three people sit at their computers and speak to each other for an hour. Yeah, this is a Zoom call. It takes brain. This is a Zoom call. This is a Zoom call. Yeah, yeah. This is a Zoom call. This is practically a Zoom call. Yeah, basically. Basically, yeah. and the guy who came up with Zoom is a fucking billionaire now. <laughs> basically, and the guy, like the guy, I think the guy that they came up with Zoom was on speed. <laughs> oh, look at that. Me too. Yeah. <laughs> So, Jim. Yeah. Yes. You are uh, good friends, Neil. I've heard. Yeah. Yes, we go way back. <laughs> you yeah. guys go way back, and I do not know you. I met you about ten minutes ago. Oh yeah. So wow, that was so. Fill me in. Tell um... me about yourself. Who are you? What do you do? How old are you? What do you? What do you? What do you aspire to be? Tell me about yourself. Man, I feel interrogated. Um, so my my name is Jim, right? And I've been friends yeah. with Neil since high school. Yeah. I am now twenty four years old, turning twenty five in about a few days. I guess. A few days, yeah, a few days. Good. We should have done this podcast as a birthday episode. <laughs> yeah, I know. Like, but um, guess what? Uh, well. I I guess I study full time and I guess in in the time that I'm I guess like not studying I socialize. 
I am pretty, uh, pretty much nothing eventful's happening in my life right now, but I guess the thing that's eventful is this podcast, and I'm yeah. so happy. Oh, to what be a here. life! What an exciting life! Look at that. Yes. You know how many people can say that they are on the uh, Neil and Jay podcast? <laughs> oh my gosh! Only You're only like... club, my friend. Yeah, I'm like the I'm like the one percenters. <laughs> Basically, exactly. yeah. Just be happy. So you guys met in high school, and yeah. uh, yes, you've been friends ever since. So what did you guys bond over in high school? How did you guys meet? What happened? Oh, oh, it well, was it was like uh, I'll let Jim will talk for this one. Okay, so I don't know, but from my perspective, like we bonded over like YouTube references. It is ten o'clock a.m. Just yeah. referencing, referencing a lot of things, and like you know, yeah. like just talking and like you know imitating and mimicking like you know all these youtube stars and like um just like joking around a lot i guess like that's yeah and like the fact that we are like we're both filipino you know like it just oh yeah yeah a lot of people do bond over trauma yeah, <laughs> yeah. not trauma tribe you, you mean tribe right <laughs> the tribe no, no, no. tragedy sorry i meant tragedy <laughs> <laughs> tragedy yeah you mean trajectory <laughs> <laughs> no thank you oh yeah okay never mind. No, but i've heard you know i have actually heard the pinoy pride is a very uh yeah is the that people. the right term pinoy pride yeah, yeah. Pride? What, would, what would you call it yeah what's call the difference between panalo and pinoy what does that mean i don't know man uh, oh what's uh pinoy? what um I don't know. I have no clue. I've never heard that actually. And you yeah. call yourself Filipino. <laughs> hey, I am Australian bred as well. So Yeah. Hey, I, I have no connection to the Philippines and I knew those words. Yeah. What's your excuse? You live in oh, Cali. Man. You live in Cali, that's why. <laughs> you know what you know what? You sound like you, you could do a better job, so why don't you be Filipino? <laughs> <laughs> Listen. I would, yeah, but 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 <laughs> I value my happiness. Ah, oh, you value your penis. I mean, happiness. Sorry, my, but both, both <laughs> to different extents. <laughs> to different extents. <laughs> to different extents. <laughs> so you, you're a student. Ah, yes, yes, yes. yes. What are you studying? What are you? What are you, uh, what are you... Uh, there's this thing called community services. Yeah. Um, pretty much like gets you into like, I guess like fields like regarding like I guess like government jobs or, you know. Um, oh, I see. Like state the, jobs and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. Domestic violence, mental health, uh, community. Oh, like, I youth, see. Like youth services or you know what yeah. I mean. Yeah. yeah. I don't know about um, Australia, but people in the U.S. get pretty good benefits for being in like working for the state. Like social work. Oh, I don't know if it's called social work out here, but like, you know, I don't know, working for the state, I guess. I don't know, government work. They usually oh, get yeah. paid yeah, that's not true. that much, but their benefits are pretty good. Flexible hours and stuff like that. Yeah. Um, retirement stuff uh, and all that. But I'm, I don't know how it works in Australia. Oh, yes. I think um, community services or disability, people who work in disability services, they get paid a lot, I think. Oh yeah, yeah. That's it. Man, I wish I had one. Yeah, it says things. here the um, the community support worker jobs in Sydney ranges from sixty-five to seventy-five thousand Australian dollars. Or yeah, yeah. Yeah, so that's like that's almost twenty dollars, twenty U.S. dollars a year. That's crazy. Hmm. So that 40, is crazy. 40, it's like 43.4 thousand to... No, that's actually not bad. That's actually pretty good. How's inflation in Australia? Oh, wow. man. Inflation? I didn't yeah. realize it until I just ordered something from Uber Eats. I was like shocked. It was like $1 more expensive. Yeah. It's hard here, bro. Yeah. yeah. Bro, I live in California. I'm, I'm used to hard. <laughs> I wish I could move out of here. I want to move out of California, speaking of that. But not to Australia. Oh, yeah. How about we all make a 
community effort and we moved to New Zealand. <laughs> it's it. actually easier for us to move to New Zealand because we're leaving Australia. <laughs> Yeah, you guys like, escaped the hellhole that is Australia, and I escaped the hellhole that is California. Just move to Hawaii. <laughs> well, I'm not moving to Hawaii. They heat over there. It's disgusting. Ooh. The heat oh, wow. over there. Yeah. So you've both been to the Philippines, right? Yeah, I yes, have. yes. How's the yes. heat over there? Oh, man. Uh... Heat here is oh, dry, right. but in the Philippines, it's so humid, man. It's like literally... Every time when you're in the room, it's just like you're in a shower. You're, you're just showering in your sweat. It's oh, moist. It's, it's so moist. moist, man. Like, seriously. What part, yeah. what part of the Philippines are you guys from? Uh, Cebu. There's are you from Cebu? Cebu, Jim? Well, yeah, my thought, dad. Oh, yeah, that's right. Your dad. And your mom's from Negros? Yeah, Negros. Yeah. yeah. From what? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Hey, 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 hey. It's a place. Hey, hey. It's a place. It's a place. We're going to have to censor it's that. A place, not a <laughs> okay. It's a place, not a person. Don't get it twisted. Don't get it twisted, bro. <laughs> I'm from it Super would be the Philippines that had a name place like that. <laughs> <laughs> Typical. Um, Is that north, south, uh, west, east? Central. So, like, in the middle of the Philippines. Central. So, there's Luzon, Visayas, and Mindanao. And both of us were from the Visayas region. Mm. Yeah. Shit, I don't know what that means. Uh, all I know, the only place I know, besides like Manila and Cebu. Yeah. And and the other one now, um, it's like Iloilo. Oh, uh, that's I the think. other side. That's still Visayas, but like, we're from Cebu. Oh, it is. Yeah. Okay, mm. so Visayas, so that's kind of like what a state. Uh. Oh, I think it's like a region. So there's three regions, like three major island groups. Luzon is where Manila is in. Um, okay. Cebu is where um, Cebu is in the Visayas region, and then Mindanao is like where um, Davao and these other cities are in. Like, so, you know, you remember Ray? Yeah. Jay. Yeah, she's she's from Mindanao. So that's that's, that's the south. Yeah. But yeah, I haven't talked to her ever. That's right. And like in the past, fucking what? How long did I meet you? 2020. 2020. So I haven't talked to her in four years. Because I met, I met you through her. Uh, exactly, I met yeah. her first. I yeah. talked to her for a couple of days. Then she introduced me to you. Yeah. And then I just did, I just stopped talking to her. I don't know why. That was like during COVID era, though. It was like lockdown times. Remember yeah, that? Yeah, was when I was getting on that, that website to just talk to random people. Yeah. Oh, I speak random? Shit, yeah, that's what it was called? Yeah, that's what it was called. They changed it, like, a lot over the years. So, wait, you guys have been for how long? Four years? Yeah, four years, Thanks. basically. Yeah. 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 Tell me more about that. How did that go? I just, I just got in a, I was bored as fuck. So I decided, yeah. you know what? I like talking to people. I yeah, like meeting true. people. I like yeah. meeting friends. I like talking to people. So I was like, I joined this. I, I looked up random websites to talk to people. And there was this one called Speak Random, where you oh, could yeah. join a random like voice chat room. Yeah. And talk to people there. And I got to a random room where there was a couple people, among them Ray. And I started talking to her. And then after a while, um, I think she invited Neil over or something. Yeah, and then uh, and, I think we yeah. were on the same Discord as well. Yeah, I've known him ever since. Oh, yeah. No, we no, you invited me to that Discord uh, shortly after that. Was it the Abs server or was it my server? It was yours. Yeah, that's all right. Yeah. I don't remember any other one. But yeah, and I just started talking to Neil. He started talking to me. We started talking mutually. Yeah. And, uh, yeah, I think I think initially we kind of bond, bonded over our uh, interest yeah. in like programming and, and and stuff like that. Oh, I think cool. you wanted to like uh, you were learning how to code back then or something. Yeah, like that. then I just gave uh, up. It's too hot. <laughs> and I think I was gonna help you with a project. Yeah. And, oh. And we ended up not, not doing it. Yeah. And so we decided, you know what? If we're not gonna do uh, programming, let's talk professionally. Yeah, well, he did. 
we, but Jay did help me with the project. Um, he helped me with the song lyrics called "Broken from the Start." Oh, it's yeah. a rap song. Yeah, I, I was surprised they actually matched yeah. the the song. So, would you consider yourself Jay like a lyricist in a sense? Oh, absolutely. I do. I do. I do love me some writing. Oh, you like yeah, writing? I yeah, do, he I does do a lot of writing. You like jazz? Master writing. I do love jazz. <laughs> I listen to jazz while I write sometimes. I actually like jazz. It's like that's the thing. Like, they're like my um, my partner, my missus, like was was in a um, was in a work meeting, and like I was just in the middle of it. And I was like, just there, and like, you know, they were they were doing the meeting and everything, and like all you can hear in the background is just this, it's the most jazziest song ever, <laughs> and I'm, and I'm just like I'm just bopping my head and like, and the and the manager that's like you know conducting the whole meeting is just noticing me, <laughs> just oh my god, just, like, just bopping to the beat, man. Like, yeah. Hell yeah. Yeah. Man, I'm I'm a music man. I love music. Same. I love music. I love shit like that. It gets me going. Oh, yeah. Well, I think I just forgot to tell you about myself, like in that about me segment, right? Um, yeah. Not not that this is not that this has a formula or anything, but <laughs> um, <laughs> but <laughs> but um, yeah. Keep talking I like you, that, you're gonna get kicked <laughs> off. <laughs> <laughs> not that this is uh organic <laughs> you know what oh my gosh i like like um yeah i i make music yeah oh dope yeah, yeah. you gotta send some shit my way okay I love not to hear that it. i yes wait you mean it's shit or like like <laughs> oh my gosh <laughs> you mean shit as in shit or like music shit <laughs> i prefer the latter i would okay. much rather you send okay. the latter my way you prefer so the latter because <laughs> when you because when you say like send shit my way i'm like uh how <laughs> stool like, sample you know, like, stool sample <laughs> stool sample to la <laughs> hey stool sample to california where, where yeah. which, whichever part to california <laughs> But um, yeah, no, nah, I, I get what you mean. Uh, I will see what I have. What kind of music? And, what kind of music do you make? Uh, nowadays I make drum and bass. Awesome. But, yeah. Um, but uh, I used to I used to be in an indie band. I used to be the lead singer of that. And oh shit. Um, I used yeah. to play guitar rhythm. Like, I was a rhythm guitarist in the in the band as well. Um, and then I like before that band stuff like i used to do emo rap stuff and yeah <laughs> oh we got you got some history right there oh yeah. yeah i do so i'm i'm jumping genres basically yeah, like i just here. i just don't know where i am you or where take I sit. Your adhd medication i don't have adhd i just have audi hd audi hd audio hd i don't know what that <laughs> hd oh, audio <laughs> hd audio <laughs> <laughs> yeah. No, actually, no, I actually like, like, to be honest with you, I make the most muddiest tracks. <laughs> That's all right, bro. I, I'm, I'm no producer. I just, I just have ideas. Yeah. <laughs> That's all I do. Yeah, mixing is really hard, man. The audio engineering. Oh my gosh, man, it's too much effort, man. Screw, it, screw that. Like that. Yeah, engineering audio is a, is a pain. Yeah, but I think mixing mixing is fun up to a certain point. Yeah, and then it starts getting tedious. like increasingly more tedious and yeah. tedious. I I don't know. I, I feel and it also depends on what you're mixing and all that. Yeah, like, exactly. Some things require different amounts of attention to certain things and you know, stuff like that. But it's just I don't know. It's just, yeah, it's a, little, then, a little pain in the butt. But yeah, but then you have uh, DJs. You have DJs who have it easy because they'd be sampling all the time. Like, exactly. You know, like they just sample the, the, the cleanest. Sample. They sample the cleanest shit, and then like they put it together. Like, yeah. 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 I need to start you know, doing that. You know, like and like don't get me started. Like you know, like um, they they do it live. Like so, the mixing and everything. So. 
Yeah. Yeah. Shit, I should be a DJ. <laughs> I'm sorry. Like, I'm sorry if my um advertising skills are this good. <laughs> <laughs> the DJ community has a lot to thank uh, Jim for. <laughs> I just talk about DJs, bro. I'm not advertising this. Like, now this guy wants to be a DJ. <laughs> Neil, do you want to be a DJ now? Yeah, I'll, I don't mind this show. <laughs> he doesn't mind. Okay, he's kind of hooked on the get idea. Your hand, get your hands off that disc. <laughs> disc yeah, man. I, yeah, but um, yeah. I don't know. I guess if I if. Uh, did y'all watch? Sorry to get off topic. Yeah. But did yeah. y'all watch the U.S. presidential debate? No, I didn't. Why? Not so much. No, not so much. What a funny shit show. What happened exactly? Mm. What happened? Uh, fuck all and absolutely nothing. <laughs> you know what happen? They started fighting over golf at one point. What really? These these motherfuckers dead started talking about how they would beat each other at golf and how one of them sucks more at golf than the other. I was like, what the fuck are these people talking about? <laughs> I, really? Gas prices are never going down. Yeah, they're never going down. What the fuck? <laughs> they're never going down. Because of that. Yeah. Yeah. So you got two presidents talking about golf. So like one of them is just like, he can't putt for shit. <laughs> yeah, one of them was like, you got an eight handicap. But he's like, actually, it's a six handicap. And I would beat you if you played fast. Like, what the fuck are you talking about? Man? Uh, I don't know. I think it's funny. It's funny. I don't really like, I don't really do politics. I don't yeah, like same. politics like that. I try not to get into it. Yeah, same. But it mm-hmm. was hilariously incompetent. Mm. Wow. The whole thing. It was just so stupid. Yeah. So um, it was dumb. I mean, you guys that... are prime minister, right? Yeah, oh, prime yeah. minister. Yeah, we because y'all still got the the king. You <laughs> got the king. Got the king. Yeah, we, we still yeah we still part of that king thing. King thing. Did you, did you guys cry when the queen died? You know, you know, you know that king deal, whatever. You know, like Kingsman, <laughs> Kingsman. Yeah, you got the Kingsman. Yeah. Whatever it's called. Yeah, we got that king dealership, whatever the heck. <laughs> king, what's his name? King Charles, whatever. <laughs> yeah, King Charles. Yeah. yeah. Hell yeah. All right, didn't he? Didn't he like? Didn't he almost pass away? Who? Not too long ago, or something like that. He almost passed away. Who? I thought I heard something about it. King Charles. King Charles? I don't know. I don't know. I think so. Y'all don't keep up with that? Come on now. I don't know. I don't know. He doesn't really... I, I thought you meant the queen, because she's dead. Yeah, she's um, dead, bro. The queen's gone. How long ago did she die? Like, uh, like, three, like, like two months ago or something like that? 2020... Yeah, probably two like... Oh, she died two years yeah, ago. It's been like, what, a, two years almost? Yeah, two years two ago she died. Yeah, she died. Yeah. Damn. Man, time, time moves fast. She lived I almost that... up to 100. Close to 100. Almost up to 100. 96 years old, she, she died. I just imagine that, like, like, you know, King Charles is just there and, like, he gets a phone call. And it's that it's like that GDA, like, San Andreas, like, opening. It's your mom, bro. She's dead. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god <laughs> she's dead home <laughs> no fucking way all of them didn't see it coming you know what I mean what do you mean it's, it's impossible not to see the queen dying coming yeah yeah really no old. fucking shot everyone in the royal family was like yeah it's gonna happen probably tomorrow like I'm sure they have a death like date for Charles already you know oh, that's what I've always thought they know exactly when everybody's gonna die because they have it all planned out you reckon wow they know when shit's gonna happen. Oh yeah. They're like, oh, he's gonna kick a bucket in a week. Yep. They'll probably poison yeah. her. I'll poison him. Yeah. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. So like, yeah, King Charles is gonna die at this time. Oh, by the way, there's dinner at three. Um... Yeah, and then <laughs> that's, after that's that, the, that's the whole list gonna, of like. I'm probably gonna announce the new uh, monarch after that, yeah, and then. Monarch. Shit. We're still we're still on for that party at at six, right? Like, yeah. <laughs> or should we change it? You know, you want to do it before Charles dies, just in case. Uh, yes. You know? yes. Maybe yes, he sir. can be part of it one last time. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We'll we'll do that definitely. Oh, oh, man. Don't, oh, don't forget, don't forget. One of the one of the princes have a birthday tomorrow. 
Oh, yeah. We're going to have to kill her. It's really a tragedy. Jeez. Jim? Uh, yeah. yeah. I have a question for you. Another segment. Another segment. This time, mm -hmm. this is a segment. This is an actual proper segment. All right. You ready? Is there, is there a theme song yeah. to this segment? Like, Not what? another theme song. What do you think mm -hmm. of ancient aliens? <laughs> no, I did this was getting brought up. Ancient aliens. Yes, sir. Like, 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 how ancient? Like, <laughs> ancient aliens. Just aliens from ancient times. What do you reckon? What's your thoughts on it? Hmm. I would say, ah, oh, man. I don't know much about these things. I guess. <laughs> <laughs> That's I'm, right. <laughs> I'm too like I'm too simple for this. <laughs> ruin the segment, Jim. Boo, boo! Way to ruin the segment. <laughs> what the segment? One There's no formula. The this is the out. formula. The one part that was planned out. I know, but what segment? Because there's no formula. <laughs> this, is <the> formula. <laughs> this was the formula, Jim. <laughs> it was the formula. We need the baby formula. <laughs> This whole podcast is an excuse to build up to that question. <laughs> and I have a feeling this whole this whole podcast was just to you just you, you trying to like talk. Just <laughs> <laughs> you trying to talk. You know? It's so spot on, man. Come on. That's actually straight up, straight up proof. This podcast is just a fun excuse for me to talk to the people. Yeah. I just try to talk and I yap a lot. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. I forgot to give you that little heads up at the beginning. I'm supposed to do it. I yap a lot, so if you get me talking about something and I'm talking a little too much, you can tell yeah. me to shut the fuck up at any time. All right. It's alright. It's alright. That I'll... works out here. Yeah. Uh, okay. I like this podcast. Yeah. There's no formula. There's no rules. You could tell the guy to shut the f up. But... <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> It's super there's, fun. I mean, if something does go awry, you can take it up with Neil. I don't uh, take complaints. There's there's two um, Asians in this podcast. Asian invasion. I know. I'm talking to two <laughs> Asian, like Filipino Australians. Isn't that crazy? Yeah, it's crazy, bro. You have, uh, you have the uh, you have the uh, the uh, the founder of this podcast who has commitment issues with his partner. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Can't even. Can't even say, can't even say, and Neil. <laughs> listen, listen, listen. <laughs> listen, listen. <laughs> what? Listen. What? Ownership is not given away. It's earned. And okay. Neil here. How does he have to earn it? How? <laughs> by. <laughs> by what? Uh, by. Well, my black sheep. <laughs> yeah, if I said it, then he'd just do it. It wouldn't be fair. He has to, it has to come from him naturally, organically. You know organical. What the organical. <laughs> you, you, know, you know what the problem is? The reason why you can't come up with an answer? What? It's because there's no formula. <laughs> well, that's actually where you're right. And, and you know what? That's actually exactly why it's the, the, J, the J podcast featuring Neil. Because... <laughs> and Neil... I, I, I'm in the I, middle of this podcast. I am the end. Okay? <laughs> the end. <laughs> I presented the idea to him of of coming up with the formula for this, and he ain't listening to me. <laughs> what, do you mean? what was the formula for him? Like, what you what you say beforehand? Like, you know, before everything, before interviewing people. Oh, <laughs> uh, so I don't have to discuss that with guests. <laughs> Excuse me. That's the thing. Uh, I'm in, not, in this I'm, case, I'm not... both of you guys are guests. Oh. I'm, I'm, I'm more your legal advisor. <laughs> legal advisor. No, but the formula that I was actually talking about was... Yeah. Was what? Well, I did say verbatim that we should not plan it out and just kind of talk and see what yeah, it takes. Yeah, play player. But okay. I also... I like um, you know... Whatever. You know, you look at all these podcasts are super pre-planned and stuff like that, right? Mm. Doesn't feel natural. They, feels, they, feels like an interview, right? Yeah. 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 
So my plan was to make a podcast. It just feels like we're just hanging out. Yeah. Wow. I'm I in my you. pajamas right now. I'm yeah. sitting in a in the world's most comically uncomfortable chair. Oof. Uh, the you Game guys of Thrones are... chair? What? The Game of Thrones chair? <laughs> it's worse than that. It's made of oh. wood. Oh, it's a wood. Smoking it's me all... everywhere. Wait, hold up. You did not just compare wood to swords. <laughs> swords are not that bad. If they're smoothed out and stuff like that. I mean, you don't move around too much. You can you, you can avoid getting cut. This thing is like violating my spine right Oof. now. And you can get splinters. Exactly. Yeah. A splinter can go to my heart and I could die. So yeah. Damn. Don't get that messed up. It's a you're, lot, you're, lot you're worse just, uh... than a sword because it's a silent killer. It can kill me any moment, any given moment. Give it time and I could be gone. Halfway through this podcast, I could be gone. No. <laughs> um, and wouldn't that be tragic? Because then you wouldn't have a podcast. There'd be no one to be guest to. You know. You know. You know. You know that. You know when you say that that the splinter could go in your heart and die. That gives that gives me the vibe of like when my missus says, "No, I could trip on this card and it could choke me." <laughs> what? She actually says that. <laughs> That's what my missus says. Like, oh my gosh, like, what how, the hell? how the heck do you how how can you trip on a cord and then get choked? <laughs> right. You know how many people have fallen victim to, to what overconfidence? <laughs> oh, if you believe that that cord cannot strangle you, it will. If you believe that it <laughs> might, it won't. But what if you, what if you have overconfidence in the sense where, like, if you believe that cord can choke you, then it will choke you. But I very well might. But you got to be prepared. <laughs> you got to be prepared. prepared. I am currently sitting in a room with a fan over my head. It could fall on me at any moment. This could be the end of my life. I could very well pass away right here. So just, could you guys. You guys are literally in Australia. Anything could fucking happen. Yeah, sure. Enough. For, en- enough of that Murphy's law. <laughs> Murphy's law. I, I like you guys. Out of everyone in this world, should understand that you guys are Australian. <laughs> a monster could burst your door down at any given moment. You, you say you say we're Australian as though we're aliens or something like. That. <laughs> you guys are Australian, and like, I'm just like man, I just I just felt my chest perk up as soon as you said that. <laughs> Australia. <laughs> do you guys, do you guys know the Australian national anthem? Yeah, well, I'm not gonna oh, sing yes. it. Yes, I'm not gonna sing it either. You can uh, you can Google it. You can just imagine I, it. I guess, yeah, I guess you guys are not going to sing it because you don't know it. It's okay. No, it's, you know it. You no, just don't want to sing it. It's fine. It's fine. It's all right. It's all right. <laughs> I wouldn't know it either if I was Australian. Yeah. The guilt tripping is real. Do you guys actually say Mickey's? What? No. We say Maccas. Maccas. That's it. Maccas. Maccas, yeah. And you say... As heading to Maccas, I saw a crack in Shayla. <laughs> Hey, hey, hey that's so bad. That impression's so bad. <laughs> that was so British. That was more British than like. Okay, wait, wait, wait. wait. <laughs> but like, hey, hey, hey. Right. We say Maccas. You say Mickey D's. I've never said that in my life. Well, some uh, some Americans. <laughs> yeah. My fellow Americans. I... My fellow Americans. Are you Obama? <laughs> <laughs> my fellow Americans. Yeah. My fellow Americans. Yeah, yeah, I did. Today we were having Mickey D's. <laughs> wait, all right, wait. I was going to. Oh, I was going to Macca's and I saw Crack and Sheila. Does that sound a little better? That sound a little better. Uh, it's it? still British. You sound, uh, uh, you sound like you sound like you 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 have a British punk band. Yeah. Good on you, mate. Good on you, mate. I was Macca's today. I saw Crack and Sheila. It's more like good on you, mate. Oh, How you doing? Fucking... Fuck. How do you guys? Okay, can you guys say Get something up. in Australian? <laughs> no. Like, uh... Fuck, bro, you're built as a bloody shit house. Shit, shit house, shit house, yeah. Shit house. You know a b- bloody shit house. <laughs> I saw the <laughs> yeah. I saw fucking Scottish yeah, when I saw a bloody shit, shit house. house. <laughs> you found... Get out of my house. <laughs> Get out of my house. <laughs> Oh, did I tell you that time? Did I tell you that time, Jay, when I um, developed foreign accent syndrome? Uh, I re- I I think I, you mentioned it. Yeah, I think I uh, for a whole week. 
Facts. For a whole week, I had foreign accent syndrome. I had a Scottish accent. It was so weird, man. Like, oh my gosh. Bro, I it wish that would happen. You know how many times I've woken up and I'm like, please, I want to sound fucking Irish. You know, I used to trick people thinking I was Irish. Yeah, I heard. I would, school, I would tell people I was Irish and I would put on an Irish accent when I was talking then, to them. But then imagine if you just woke up one day and then you just started sounding Vietnamese. Like, <laughs> okay, now that would be terrible. Okay. You know right. I mean? I'm taking a gamble. I can be <laughs> taking a gamble? Yeah. Yeah. So you can't be overconfident. You will die of overconfidence, as yeah. you said. Uh, yes, exactly. You get too comfortable, you get too confident, it's going to get you. Don't get yeah. you. Vietnamese accent on the way. What do they sound like? I'm not going to try to do it. <laughs> uh, but, uh... No, you're going to get, like, this This podcast will be canceled, like, the next season. Like, <laughs> yeah, we need to, we need to just speed run all the episodes we have planned and then just <laughs> it before, before anyone finds out. Yeah. You know, if this was, li- if this was live, I would, I would keep saying, chat, is this real? <laughs> chat. Chat. Speaking of that, Chat, speaking Chat, of that, what do you think? Chat. Um, for the for the coming episodes, uh, the guests are of Megan the Stallion. <laughs> oh my gosh! Oh, yeah. Yeah. Why would you be on this podcast? I don't know. Uh, yeah, don't test me. I'll get her on the podcast. <laughs> don't, don't, oh, I can't don't. Fucking hear anyone on the podcast. Just oh, no. me. And and next week we have Ice Spice. <laughs> <laughs> You ate the fart. <laughs> you ate the fart. Yeah. Well, guess what? Like, you know what? In order to invite those people, it'd be nice if we had a formula. <laughs> Which we will. But by <laughs> next episode, we will definitely have one. Oh my God. And you will. And you will say, and Neil. And Neil. <laughs> uh, that depends. <laughs> on what happens between today and next episode? If if he gets and, his shit together and we get this formula working, yeah. then I, I might share the glory with him. <laughs> and we should. And, and and guess what? We should be talking like this and the rest of the podcast. <laughs> yeah, I think we should. No, I I, I don't think so. <laughs> I think so. It adds character to it. Oh crap! I can't stop. <laughs> Help! Ah fuck! We're stuck. Neil, what do you have to say? Nothing. Oh, you ruined it. Okay. Oh, so speaking <laughs> of formula, here's another question that I've thought of to ask yeah, everybody. What? What's up? Do you yeah. play Dungeons and Dragons? No, I don't. Uh, I've never played okay. it. Okay, I, I rolled a 20 and I can comfortably say yes. I... <laughs> you rolled a 20? Uh, I, would you guys be I, interested in potentially pay, playing a, a full-on D&D campaign? I've never I played would it. die. I would die within the first five minutes. <laughs> Perfect. What? Perfect. I'll write you in as a fucking skeleton. Nah, I'll be I'll be dragonborn, and everybody will be scared of me. How does it work? And then, and then I'd be saying, and then I'd be saying, I would just splash. I would just splash. I would just splash. <laughs> what? That's that's a spell, bro. Okay. You know what? We've decided what? Jim is playing, and he's going to be a dragon. I'm going to be dragon bar. All right. So yeah, that's me trying to recruit uh, people for my D and D campaign in every single one of these episodes. Oh my god! So uh, Jim, you are officially part of it. You will die in the first session. Know. but You will be part of it. Jim, I I ain't joining this cult. <laughs> I ain't joining this cult. Oh, you have to. I'm t- uh, you Ask- do not have okay. a choice. I would get Neil to go to your house and fucking record you. <laughs> what? No, I don't care. I, I thought you were gonna say you're gonna get Neil and he's gonna he's gonna put a bag over your head and like kidnap you and like drag you all the way to California. <laughs> uh, even better. Oh crap! I'll do that. I, I, will. I just I just gave I just gave Neil ideals. <laughs> no, <I'm fine. laughs> Yeah, ship him over. Express shipping. Ship him over. Ship him over. Hey, ship him over. hey Jay, 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 I'm just going to have to humbly decline your offer on the DD. Like, you can ask Ice Spice next time. Shit. <laughs> I will. Or, Ma- yeah, I'm sure or, or Megan, sure. you even have Megan the Stallion. You have Megan the Stallion in the, in the next month, so, like, you should. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, she's going to be a guest anyway, so might as well get her on so, D&D, right? <laughs> yeah, exactly. So you you'll be like pointing your two fingers 
at each other and you'd be like, so Megan, can you, um, uh, can you, can you, uh, join my D&D? <laughs> I'm sure she'd say yes. She's cool like that. She's not a coward like some people I know. <laughs> wow. I wonder who they are. Hmm. 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 I really wonder who. This well, podcast will forever be mine. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, Unless. There's just one, one question. <laughs> I just made a segment. Just one question. <laughs> oh shit, he's taking over. <laughs> just one question for you, Jay. Yeah. Where does this get uploaded? <laughs> is there? Is it like in a void or something? Like what happened? <laughs> like, well, uh, Jim. To yeah. answer your question, because I know exactly what you're trying to say, and I don't what appreciate it. I appreciate um, it. What you're trying to say? You know what an Amazon warehouse is? Oh, yes. It's where Amazon stores all the products uh, that they uh, sell on their website. Uh, now, the owners industry. of those products are not Amazon. It is uh, people, uh, companies, yeah. independent companies, not part of Amazon, uh, for the most part. That. Yes. Uh, decide to have their products sold on Amazon at or from the Amazon warehouses, right? Gotcha. So, uh, the fact that this podcast <laughs> is um, being uploaded onto Neil's channel Are you saying in no way podcast? implies that this is Neil's podcast. It oh implies that I have commanded him to upload it onto his channel. Oh, so Jay, Jay, Jay. That's, yes. From, coming from what you said, it should be, yes. it should be Neil and Jay. Right? No, 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 no. Because, <laughs> because again, he, yeah, this is my property, and I, insist, so right. I am allowing him to post it onto his channel. But it is, it is my property. So, so Jay, so Jay, when you when you say that, is it because you're not bothered making your own channel? I actually had one that got uh, suspended because I posted porn by accident. Oof. How is that? How how do you do that by accident? I don't know actually. So I was just clicking on porn, and then I just accidentally pressed upload, and then I, I think I was I, fucking I, around with like some friends or something, and I accidentally uploaded it to YouTube or like streamed oh. it. I think I streamed it live. Oh, oh yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. Damn. Anyway, that's beyond. That's uh, besides the point. Uh, the so point here, in fact, the matter is that. This is my property. I, <laughs> I was originally. You make it sound like it's land. Idea. We've come Bro, up with this. I, like, I came up with this idea. If this you completely like... ignore the fact that this was originally Neil's podcast featuring Jay, and I was just featured in every single episode to the point where we decided to just make one with both of us. Yeah. If you ignore that, no, it's then okay. It really was my I think, idea. I think I think Neil's gonna like either way type in Neil featuring Jay. Like, <laughs> <laughs> Either way, no matter what you say. I think. What do you think? We need to meet in the middle and make this Jim's podcast. <laughs> no, no, no. I think we need to meet in the middle of the middle and move to New Zealand. <laughs> meet in the oh, middle of the middle. New Zealand and then start calling the podcast podcast featuring Jay, <laughs> Neil, and Jim. Featuring everyone. Uh, featuring everyone. I no, no, I don't. I don't think you're ready for that commitment. So I think it'd be podcast featuring Jim and Jay featuring Neil. <laughs> you're right. That's that does sound right. Oh my gosh. So that, that's the middle of the middle of the middle. So. <laughs> or, oh, or yeah. what we can do is we can uh, we can name it Jay's podcast featuring Jim, and yeah. then in the description. We credit Neil as additional voices. Oh, oh my gosh. Yeah, I'm an AI voice now. <laughs> well, how about this? How about this? Since your name is Jay, why don't we say Jay's podcast, but then next to your name, there's a bracket, and the J stands for Jim. <laughs> <laughs> and then the it says... Starts for and, and the Y stands for... You. Yeah. <laughs> what? This is the gym and you me, me, meaning meaning that it's the whole world and us. Like, <laughs> the world exactly. and us. 
<laughs> like, you know what I mean? Except for Neil. <laughs> Except for Neil. Neil, Neil means nothing. Un- Neil can be an okay. uncredited actor. It's a ghostwriter. It's a ghostwriter. And bro, Jay, Jay, why, why didn't you like instead of naming the the podcast Jay featuring Neil? Why didn't you say Jay except Neil? Jay except Neil. What? You're throwing out some good ideas. I think we can get along. Uh, yes, we can. <laughs> And we can uh, we can certainly like open up our own apple cider brewery. Apple yeah, cider or brewery. maybe make our own podcast, and maybe we can invite Neil as a guest every now and then. Yeah, that'll be nice. <laughs> That's if 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 we if you be, if you if you be in the middle, yeah. That's if yeah. you be in the middle. In the middle, the middle, the middle, 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 middle. <laughs> middle Earth. Middle, 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 middle Earth. We uh, can meet. I will meet you guys at Antarctica. Listen, you know what? <laughs> I That's I will cold, actually take Neil and Jay. All right, I'll take that. But really, okay. Since I have no guaranteed profit uh, off of AdSense on this video, I require <laughs> a salary. Okay. Where are we going? And that should be paid out, I think by neil but also as you know his biggest proponent by jim as well i think you guys should pay out of my salary wait what how what how does this work neil explain i don't know man don't tell us to me another segment <laughs> another segment uh, jay explains how he's going to get paid for the podcast <laughs> listen yeah no yeah and, all and, i'm asking yeah. i'm not asking for all i'm asking for minimum wage Okay. All right, $25. You know what's so funny? You know what's so funny? In California. <laughs> right, 25 but you, know... <laughs> no, but you know what's so funny? If you called that a segment, like, every episode would you would, would be you talking about financials. <laughs> <laughs> and now you're talking, okay. When you talked about formulas, I didn't think you were thinking, but now you're thinking. Now you're, now you're thinking. Now you're talking. <laughs> Now I'm just like, so now we get onto the financial side segment. Da, 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 okay, so we are <laughs> so formulas and finances. Formulas and finance podcast. Yeah. What so, do you guys have any money invested? Nah. Um. No, I don't think I have enough to pay you for your. Yeah, money. I don't have enough to pay you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I think. I, know, bro. I, I, I think. I think that's the running gag of the segment. Is that we say no, we don't have money. To pay you well <laughs> i'm quite risk averse when it comes to uh my finances so i would say that we need to meet meet at a point where it would be affordable for you guys and lucrative to me right that I being have... said maybe yep. minimum wage may be a little too much to pay up front so i'll take half of that so i'll only take seven dollars an hour i'll take I that can pay... i can pay you in peanuts <laughs> <laughs> okay. no but what you can do is pay me in stocks in a peanut company um I can pay you in Coke. You want Coke? You, you can, can pay me in options at a Coke company. Yeah. Hmm. I could just give you, you solid Coke. In... <laughs> Do you guys dabble in crypto or anything like nah, that? Nah, I don't. Nah. Do you? Do you guys dabble in um, NFTs? The, the stock market? Nah. I mean, I want to, but it's too risky, man. Oh, see, yeah, you man. guys are what, uh, in business, we call... Financially illiterate. Mm. Oh wow! Yeah, we have a name for you guys. Uh, but don't worry. Who's, who's we? First of all, who's we? Like, define we. Who is we? Well, the people in the business, you know. The smart ones, like <laughs> the people in the business. Who is this business? The one person. Who is this business people? Who are these business the people? <laughs> Why you keep talking about these business people? So while you guys are busy, you know, mocking me in your. <laughs> I know, I get it, I get it. You're going to be some rich CEO in the future, but we don't care. Like, we're oh, living in the present. In the future, excuse me. Excuse me, sir, you don't, you don't. There is no bro, future. Be... Bro, there I is no future. You could be dead in the next minute, like. Exactly, which is why. It's been a hot so minute. Now, I have decided to make all my fortune today. Really? Oh, okay. Nice. Who's your inheritance? Before the end of this podcast, okay. I will have made my first million. Really? Ooh, yeah. Nice. Wait, so how? like how? 
Ah, uh, another How much segment. Time do you guys have? Another segment. How? He's lying. Don't listen to it. We can start by uh, uh, with a okay, this, generous this, this, donation. This is another segment. This, <laughs> this is the next segment. It's called scamming. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. No, I no, no, no. no. You don't know how to scam me. I would never. I would never scam anyone. I would try. Bro, you <laughs> asked for a donation. What the heck does that mean? <laughs> That is asking for a donation. I'm not scamming. I'm telling you. What is, I, okay, what's the cause? Ligma? Me becoming a millionaire before the end of the podcast. Is <laughs> that even a cause? Bro, you just made a Patreon. <laughs> just made a Patreon. Is this I, a I Patreon? Could, for could make, we need to make a Patreon for the for the for the for the, for the J podcast. Yeah, uh, for the tr- Neil, get on that. Yeah. Make a Patreon, Patreon. For, New, for New Zealand. Make <laughs> a Patreon for New Zealand? Yeah, open it up with a New Zealand bank account <laughs> so we just have everything ready over there. Yeah, so that we can live together and finally be a happily family and we can say and. <laughs> and. Comfortably. And. If you guys prove to be <laughs> of enough use to me, then I'm happy with that. Oh, no, it's not you using us. We're going to be using you. <laughs> oh, well, I am. I am quite an asset. I will say that. Yes, an ass. It. <laughs> Listen here. Jimmy. I said acid. Hey, I said acid. <laughs> you just said it slowly, that's all. I didn't say ass hat, I said acid. <laughs> I, don't, I don't appreciate your tone. <laughs> you, don't, you don't ass appreciate what? <laughs> <laughs> I'm looking sorry. here. Fucko. I can't look. I'm Asian. <laughs> <laughs> I can't see. I can't see. I just want to say, for purposes of my ass, I, 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 I did not partake in that joke. I didn't say that. That was Jim. For, I, for, do for, 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 I do not condone. I do not condone. Do not condone. For for full disclosure, you get to stop. For for full disclosure, please do. You get to stop. <laughs> Okay, uh, I think so. That was that was the brain rot um segment. Yeah. So now, let's, now let's go. Yeah. Oh wait, we didn't sing. Um, no, we're not the doing Scooby that. Scooby Doo Riz Ohio song. Scooby Doo yeah, well. Riz Ohio. Taking out your cat for the. Ri- okay, never mind. Man, um, we really do need a format. Holy shit! Exactly. Like everything. We need the formula, the- man. Uh, this was Everything. supposed to be the catch-up episode where we were going to talk about our lives. I know, I know. We can know, do it what now. What has happened since the last time, and, and then getting, uh, me getting to meet Jim and, and talking I, to him, seeing how you guys met, and we ended up fucking doing this bullshit. Well, I think I think that's what what's good about it is that like we're just talking, yeah, like about, and that's us, you know, like that's true. It I captures guess. the essence of the people. Yeah, it captures. You know what? Like, can, I have just Jim. one question. I just have one question. <laughs> what? I have just. What is your What is your profile picture? Is it like from JoJo or something? Like I don't know what it is. that is. It is. That's what's JoJo? JoJo. Part seven. Run. Oh, part seven. Okay. No wonder why yeah. I don't recognize it. Because like it's the same. It's the same art. Like who's the character? It's Jaro Zapelli. He's the, the next JoJo. No, he's like his bro. That's you know with him the whole time. So well, what what part is the JoJo with the where they race? You know, it's a steel ball, or whatever. That's that's part seven, steel ball run. Oh, so, so is that being yeah. animated at some point, or like is that? Uh, just... it's the next one up. Uh, I pray to God they don't animate it. Oh, oh, guys, audience, audience, chat, chat, whatever. Like this segment is called anime. Yeah, we have an anime segment. This is relatable yeah. to people. Yeah. Yes. Um. I hope to God it doesn't get animated. Because holy shit. Okay. You can't animate. Steel Ball Run is absolutely a masterpiece. Okay. And it is mm-hmm. one of the best pieces of literature I have consumed. And that's saying something because I usually do not like uh, anime and or manga wait to like that much because I don't think it's, you know, it's not like, you know, it's not the type of literature or media that I like consuming, but Steel Ball Run mm. is something different. Uh-huh. And Jojolian too. Part 8 is also by Jojo in general, but Part 7 is on a league of its own. And I yeah. just don't think you can take what happened and, and how it was written and how it was developed and how it was 
Like man, I remember back it and yeah. adapt it. Yeah. It's like I remember like back in the day where there used to be like edits or like not edits but like more like fan like fan animations of that of that variation of JoJo of part 7. It's like pretty pretty decent. It wasn't that bad. But yeah. Um pretty fucking dope. Yeah. Yeah. I only played like the part seven characters. Like, do you remember that that game like called JoJo, JoJo's Bizarre Adventure, um, Eyes of the Heaven? Yeah, Eyes of the Heaven. Yeah. Yeah, that's. I think that I just. Dumb. I think I just incorporated the Japanese accent while saying that Eyes of the Heaven. <laughs> Eyes of the Heaven. <laughs> Eyes of Heaven's a good one. I don't think that one has JoJolian characters though. I think that came out before JoJolian got completed. Mm, but yeah. All Star Battle, the the other fight, the fight game. It did. Uh, it does have Jojolian character. Jojolian's also. So yeah, is so that um, so is that the deal with that like hairstyle where it's just like straight down? Was it? I forget how to, I forget how to describe. No, his so. Hair. Uh, no. we're getting into spoiler territory for Jojo. <laughs> by the way, <laughs> that's all right. Um. So yeah. By Dio. the way. The... Okay. So yeah. part. Do you have any interest in Jojo at all to watch it or read it? Minus spoiler or two, a big spoiler or two. Um, who? Okay, so, uh, part six. At the end of part six, something wacky happens, and the universe gets reset about like twenty million times. <laughs> and so, <laughs> Steel Ball Run and listen, part seven and eight, Steel Ball Run and Jojo Lee, and technically take place in the same world, but after it's been reset like twenty million times because time got sped up like a billion fold, right? Mm. Who's who? So who's it's a standing? different. Thing, but it's also supposed to be kind of a parallel to to, to the previous parts, right? So, yep. um, there's a character. So Dio was a character from part one all the way through part six, and that's probably the one that you're more familiar with. And then in part seven, um, there's a character also referred to as Dio, but his name is actually Diego, and he mm-hmm. he's a jockey as well. Um, he kind of has a he has a hat that says Dio on it. Like a jockey hat that has the the word D on it, it's pretty cool. Stands are also a, a phenomenal in part. Uh, I mean, stands are phenomenal in parts uh, three, four, five, and six. But stands in parts seven and eight are just very interesting. A lot more. It focuses a lot less on the spectacle of being like a shonen anime, and you can see the maturity of uh-huh. JoJo from part one through part eight. Right? You can see it become something a little more literary and a little more you know, in certain ways, introspective and stuff like that. Um, You take that quick turn from, you know, like, oh, we have stands that have really cool and interesting powers fighting each other to, like, a more meaningful interaction between the characters that sometimes doesn't get resolved with, like, a big fight. Sometimes it gets resolved with a very interesting use of stands and stuff like that. Stands are more of a vehicle for a lot of things. Um, And they're just really cool. I I love it. They also, you know, it's like, it's just cool how they did it. Um, yeah. I love part seven. Part seven is so fucking cool, and the characters are so the characters are beautifully written, like yeah. beautifully written, and the premise. I mean, you know the premise of part seven? No, no, not necessarily. No, it's about a, a paraplegic uh, jockey from Kentucky yeah. and wow. an Italian executioner racing all all across America to prevent fighting dinosaurs to prevent the president of the United States from obtaining the body of Jesus Christ. What? And Jesus Christ is a legit character in Jojo Part 7. It's it's nasty. You know, he's Damn. actually technically the the first Jojo canonically. I never knew that. Jesus Christ, Jojo Christ. Yeah, cuz his name was technically Josh uh, like Joshua Josephson. Oh, cuz Joseph. Yeah, I get. Yeah, and he has a stand technically. Or his his body enables a stand. It's technically a stand, but it doesn't. He doesn't manifest it himself because he's mostly just talking to to the protagonist, kind of guiding him through certain things, right? Uh. Um. But he does present his stand at a certain point, and uh, I'm gonna stop myself because I could talk about JoJo all day. Yeah. <laughs> okay, um, so, and that, um, ladies and gentlemen, that, ladies and gentlemen, was the end of the anime segment. Yes, and yes. on to the, um, the, uh, I swear there should be, there should be theme songs in some of these yeah, segments. Yeah, like, should. Or whatever, I don't know, some jazz? Like jazz? 
Have you guys played uh, Elden Ring? No, I haven't. No, no. no. I played Dark Souls, but I was too hard. I never finished it. The game I'm playing right now is Yakuza. Which one? Um, Which one? Like a Dragon Infinite Wealth. Oh, shit. <laughs> Yeah, uh, is that I, just, like a dragon? I just I just finished like a dragon, and I was like, try out this game takes forever. <laughs> and then, like as soon like as soon as I finished it, I realized I had another thing that takes forever. Which one? Infinite wealth. Oh. <laughs> I'm like crap. More hours. More hours. To waste. Pump, punch uh, punch the numbers. <laughs> yeah. And that's the thing too is that like you're you're in Hawaii, and I'm just like. Why is it called infinite wealth when you're infinitely broke? <laughs> <laughs> just maybe that's what he dreams. That's maybe realized... that's his desire. You know you what I mean? realize you mentioning that? Yeah. Well, a brief parenthesis. I'm about to do something unheard of before. I'm about to merge two segments together briefly. Oh, crazy. Um, oh. you mentioned like Yakuza Infinite Wealth. It takes place in Hawaii. Yeah. Some mm -hmm. bullshit. Yeah. Part nine of JoJo. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh, he's about JoJo. a little kid in Hawaii trying to become a millionaire, and he's a gangster. He's part of a gang. Uh, he's That's trying to make right make it big in Hawaii. He's trying to become a a, a little a quintillionaire. <laughs> he's close. Anyway, let's keep That's going. That's him. He's it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, um, I'm in the story so far. Like, I think I'm in like the fifth chapter, and I'm just like. Yeah, this game's like, you know, it's like, Yakuza games like, kind of fall with that same like, kind of fall into that same trap of like, you know, like being slow at the start. Yeah. You know, because it's it, it's technically a beat-em-up like, or like, you know, turn-based whichever Yakuza game you play like, it's basically that, but it's also a uh, it's like also one of those text games, you know? Like, like, you know, um, say for example, uh, it's like Ace Attorney, or like, it's like Dagen, Dagen Roth. Oh, so like dialogue. Like, yeah, it's like dialogue games, like, basically. Yeah, but like, yeah, yeah. yeah. But it's like cutscene heavy, but like, at the, at the end of the day, it's like, it's like one of those games. Yeah. Like, just, it's, it's story, it's rich, it's story driven, it's like rich in story. Like, yeah. just like far out, like, can I just skip all these cutscenes? Like, <sighs> I can. But, but like you wouldn't understand but as soon as as soon as I skip, I'm bursting this boss. Like <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm like crap, I didn't even prep for this. I just I just saw a boring ass like, you know, cutscene. And now I'm off fighting this like this high level like Yakuza boss. <laughs> <laughs> that I didn't even prep for. I didn't even like buy I didn't even buy supplies for. And now I'm just I'm just grinding my teeth. Like doing yeah. Try, trying to fight him. That's Yakuza for you. It's like, damn. Imagine like watching a cutscene and then like you know you skip it, and then and then you're just like versing an Elden wrong, Elden Ring. Boss. Elden wrong. Yeah. Holy shit. Elden. I, Elden I haven't Ring. played that one. I'm, uh, that sounds cool though. <laughs> Elden Ring. Elden Ring. Elden wrong is the next game. Elden wrong. <laughs> Elden wrong, bro. <laughs> It's just the deleted content from the game. Yeah. It's compiled into one thing. So what's the yeah. story of Elden Ring, Jay? Like, is it tied with Dark Souls or something? Brother, don't get me started. We're going to be here for two two years <laughs> with me talking to you about that bullshit. But you got me started, so let's get it going. <laughs> oh, uh, crap. Nah, There's I'm not going to bore you with all that bullshit. But it's super cool. Yeah. Uh, the 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 way the Souls games work, you know, and then an Elden Ring by they're completely different, but Elden Ring, Bloodborne, not so much Sekiro, but it's they have a story, especially more so Bloodborne and Elden Ring than Dark Souls one through oh, Blood, yeah. Dark Souls one and three. Two did have a story, but it's mostly you pick up on a lot of the lore through item descriptions, through dialogue with NPCs and stuff like yeah. that. And you kind of piece it together slowly until you get a big picture, and it's a really and it's that sounds like oh well, well they're not creating a narrative but it's actually really interesting because the way they present it to you it's like intentionally made to be shattered but it's also made in a way that it's easily communicated to you yeah through a lot of the things that you do you uh, you get to understand it almost effortlessly mm -hmm. to certain extents there's also other things that you do need to look into to understand um but 
you know, I, I, I just really like that 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 uh almost narrative vehicle that that uh from software uses with their uh games a lot. I'd say so, I I sorry. really like Bloodborne for being mm-hmm. you know this because Bloodborne starts as just like this Victorian horror game almost, yeah, right? Dark horror, dark and then it starts yeah. getting a little more cryptic and, and a little metaphysical, and then it gets very Lovecraftian. Oh, right? yeah. And oh, so yeah. then it starts transitioning to Lovecraftian horror. Mm. And it plays around with so many ideas so beautifully, and it's so beautifully written. It's one of my favorite games of all time. And then Elden Ring, I feel like it took what was so good about Bloodborne's narrative and what was so good about Dark Souls' narrative yeah. and put it together into one thing and made this beautiful thing that is... It's expansive, it's yeah. well-developed, it's incredible. Um, and it just communicated you so effortlessly because they're games that are so gameplay-focused that if they try to throw the narrative at you like mm. on your face at all times, like other like more heavily story-driven games, it would take away from another strength that it has, which is its gameplay, right? So I feel like it marries those two things absolutely beautifully by just presenting it in in bits almost throughout yeah. the whole thing you got to get to it it does a lot of showing and not telling oh, but okay. at the same time it does a lot of telling and not show oh. right it's almost like it blends that showing that showing is a tell in it of itself it's it's really interesting mm-hmm. um so you, but i'm, I'm you, trying not to talk about the actual contents oh yeah, that's all right yeah i could be here for yeah. three hours but also because i honestly think you guys should play it no, nah, no, nah, we haven't played it. I so. haven't played it. Well, I think you guys should. I mean, they're beautiful games. They are hard as fuck, but they are beautiful. Yeah. Damn. Um. So you'd say that like the story, like, is like the environment itself. That like you know, you you pick up these items and you read the lore, like as a... yeah. It's like you everything just kind of brings it. Like for Both example, together. like there's this boss, right? There's this yeah. boss and. And, and all you really know about them when you go into fight is that they are your enemy, right? But mm. throughout, like, the environment they're on tells you a lot. Maybe the people you fought, and maybe you fought an enemy, a random enemy in that area, and you picked up their boots, and you decided to look at their boot description. And the boot description gives you a little rundown of the story of that boot, right? And that boot tells you that it is a boot <laughs> of the knights of uh, General blah blah blah, and general blah 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 used to send his troops to this place during certain times of blah blah two blah 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 right and then you read another thing that says that this is a the the crest of the knights of blah 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 who were loyal to him because of blah 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 and then you realize that 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 general blah 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 was the person that you just fought so you start learning more about them just through the environment they're in right yeah uh it uses a lot of environmental storytelling Oh, and also okay. through people telling you things, right? Sometimes you see an NPC that just maybe they have a story with them. Maybe they're they they just know something, so they're like, oh yeah, you know, this yeah. place used to be blah blah blah. But it's never the game having like those big story beats where it's taking the narrative along one big path. It's yeah. more like you can explore this however you want, and it's being pieced together slowly like a jigsaw puzzle. Oh. As you go, no matter what angle you tackle it in, yeah. the story comes together because. You know, you can you can make you can build a jigsaw puzzle yeah. any way you want. You don't have to start from the bottom left corner. You can start yeah, from the middle, true. then move on to the right, the left. So it's not and that's what's so beautiful about it. Yeah, because exactly. from what I like, from what I've seen or like heard is like, you know, it kind of throws you into that world, and you choose like where to go, basically, right? Oh yeah, especially Elden Ring, right? Yeah, because it's yeah, open that's, world. That's like that's the game. Yeah, that's the game. Like it just throws you. You can in. end up. You can go from point A to point Z immediately. Well, sometimes not not that drastically because there are some story beats sometimes that need to happen for certain things to unlock and stuff. Yeah, like yeah. that. But but then you get you you know you get stuck with the whole. Well, this is a real breathing world, so I could technically go from point A to point Z at any moment, right? But at point Z, I'm gonna get my ass kicked, right? So maybe. I shouldn't go to point Z. But what's great about it is sometimes you can go po- go to point Z and because of the game, the way Dark Souls works, it's a very skill-based game. You could, in theory, at the beginning of the game, beat point Z 
if you are determined enough and perseverant enough and skilled enough to really go at it Whoa. right you could so I, you could do it i think i think like yeah like i think elden ring is like more more of an extensive more like an extensive version of um you know what nintendo players play which is like you know breath of the wild because like you can go to point z at any point in the game and fight the final boss if you're determined exactly like exactly uh, but like what i like about elden ring is that like there's more lore to it than than zelda zelda like don't get me wrong it's just i think like when you go into the field it's kind of plain and barren compared to Compared to Elden Ring, I, I will say that. Uh, however, because mm -hmm. Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom look good, that they're good looking games. Yeah. But in my opinion, at least, they're not as visually interesting as Elden Ring. Elden Ring is very, very visually interesting. Like everything you look at is almost like a little spectacle in and of itself, right? Mm. Yeah. But it's also the fact that the world is, I, I think it, because it's, it's more of like a, I feel like games that come out on Nintendo consoles exclusively are never really independent from Nintendo. Nintendo always needs to have a hand in it in some way or another oh, because really? you need to cater to their console. Um, but I, so I feel like Elden Ring dares to tackle more interesting ideas, right? Mm. Uh, narrative yeah. and gameplay wise, it tackles more interesting ideas, right? And 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 also just gameplay wise, the variety that. Um, Elden Ring allows is also crazy because Dark Souls did have one thing, which was Dark Souls. You know, it had bows, it had crossbows, it had magic, it had oh, yeah. uh, great swords, it had uh, dexterity weapons, it had daggers, right? It had all these things, but ultimately, most people ended up playing almost the same way. Uh, right? If you played as a mage, the game would be a joke. It would be insanely easy, and you basically had one spell that you could spam. Elden Ring made it so any single build that you can go for and think of, you could feasibly do and you would have the same amount of fun yeah. and the same amount of pain so it's right? like balance it is, exactly you feel like if you if you decide to go for magic depending on what school of magic you have to go for if you go for conjuration if you go for uh incantations and and stuff like that it, it, it the game is gonna have challenges for you the same way right so it's, there uh, are some bosses that will kick your ass no matter what you are and there's some bosses that will kick your ass more if you use magic more if you use you know melee uh, weapons it depends on what damn. you want to go for yeah but it just the game just makes you feel it gives you a lot of freedom for what you want to do and how you want to do things yeah you know and i just uh, I, I love that yeah. i think it's yeah like from what you say like it's more extensive than all the other games they've made previously made like yeah. far more far more extensive like Oh, absolutely! It the is. combating system and the, I guess the bosses, the way they act. Oh yeah, you can get lost in that game for hours and hours and hours and hours and hours and hours and hours, just exploring, fighting, stuff like that, and it's just beautiful. I love it, and yeah. I, again, the narrative is just amazing. I love the story. I love the world. I love the things about it. I love the place. I love what it means to the characters, and it's just so cool. It also just goes really hard. You know, it goes really hard. Mm. Like, as you, you fucking see these things, like, holy shit, that's so cool. Well, uh, there you have it, ladies and gentlemen. That was the gaming segment. Yeah. Um, now it's. That was the to... Jay yapping segment. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, Jay's yappers. Um, yep. Jay's yappers. Um, but I think now we can talk about music. Sure. Yeah. No, 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 music. Okay. <laughs> so, so, um, Jay, what is your favorite, like, genre? So, sorry, sorry. Uh, I, I mostly do hip hop, but I listen to everything really. I love hip hop. I love country. Um, I fuck with rock, blues. Yep. I love blues. But I, I would say hip hop and country are probably the things that I appreciate the most. Cool. What about you? Uh, Neil, Neil, you also, can... I love how Jimuel just took the reins. Like he, he's the host now. Yeah, he's the host now. Uh, like no, no, it got me thinking. Since you don't have a formula, I think the formula is every guest you get, they host. Oh, that's an interesting <laughs> take. That's that's a that good is one. cool as fuck. That you know cool. what? We'll keep that. We actually you know what need I mean? to hire Jim as a full time advisor for this. <laughs> I've been on no, every episode. <laughs> my 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 ideas don't come from my brain. They come from energy drinks. 
Like, <laughs> 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 you drank a potion, bro. Far out. <laughs> it's an energy potion. Like... Full energy potion. <laughs> yeah, but um, I think that I think that podcast can thrive. Like, where you find the next host. You know what I mean? Every segment. Every like. Yeah, every, we get episode. someone to do our job for us. That's, that's, that's genius. Yes, yes. So that you have an excuse to talk. <laughs> talk about oh anything you want. Oh my what? goodness. What? That's fucking genius. Is it? <laughs> yeah, okay. There you yeah, go. you're welcome. So, <laughs> so, what kind of music do you like? Uh, I think Neil should go first. Um, I listen to like um, EDM. What else? Um pop pop from like you know the old the oldies like karaoke songs or something oh yeah yeah and like mm -hmm. sometimes i listen to like music from other cultures or languages damn yeah what about you jim that's cool um i think lately i've just been like listening to some like russian sort of electronic music oh really then, oh wow. yeah like um and then like i like I've also kind of like dabbled with like funk, and then I just realized that funk just sounds the same. Yeah. <laughs> it's just, and then um, a bit of drum and bass, a bit of, you know, emo, you know, punk uh, music, and then a bit of uh, alternative rock, indie rock, um, a bit of, a bit of rap. Yeah. Um, a bit of, a bit of everything. Yeah, pretty much a bit of everything. Yeah. Um, yeah, I just... I have this playlist, and it's just, like, full of... It's just everywhere. It's just... It's all over the place. <laughs> Damn, that's nice. Yeah. Like, because I... I'm not, like, one of those people, like, that organize, like, playlists for every, like, genre, like, that I listen to. I'm just like, no, nah, I'm just gonna dump everything in this one thing, one place. Yeah. Yeah. And those you know, are the yeah. best, because then years later... Yeah. You go back and you're like, holy shit, I used to listen to that shit? Because it's all drowned out. <laughs> yeah. 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 And then you look down and you're just like, oh my gosh, I was listening to Megan Thee Stallion and, and uh, the Sabrina, Sabrina Carpenter and like, wow, it's Espresso? Like, what? <laughs> yeah. But, um, yeah, I think uh, in terms of music, like, I'm pretty much like, I don't know which genre like to like, you know, it's just, yeah, same. it's so, it's so, it's so diverse. Like, exactly. So... You don't know which one. That is true. Yeah. Especially if you, if you're someone who just appreciates music, you just appreciate yeah. as a whole. You the know? good in every genre, right? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah. The I, I just said country and hip hop because that's usually what I just align myself to when I'm just listening to stuff typically. Yeah. But fucking new metal or some bullshit like i, yeah. I can appreciate the good in new metal even though i don't listen to it that much yeah mm. stuff like that you know mm. the only yeah. the only the only genre that i was never able to get into is dubstep whoa, 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 whoa. oh yeah i don't know it's just like it's 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 kind of regressive for me i don't know even though even though i listen to like you know punk and all that like you know like like uh i just think i think it's overproduced for me which one? Uh, yeah, it's just the it's like the overproduction, like the 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 dubstep genre. Oh, yeah, hundred oh, percent. Overly, overly, like you know, synthesized. It's not like there's no organic instruments or like nothing. It's just all electronic or overly Synth produced. Yeah, yeah. But um, yeah. Um, is there anything else we shall talk about? Because I don't know how long this podcast will last. Uh, As you tell me, Chief. I'm I'm just sitting along for the ride. I'm being featured in this episode. Wait. I'm happy with it being featured, Jay. I'm happy with that now. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so I guess we, I guess we should talk about the future of this podcast. Oh, um, I see. It's bright. It's bright. Yeah. It's bright, bro. So yeah, it it sounds pretty bright. So like, you know what vibe i kind of get out of this like you know like if it's if it's gonna be like if it's gonna be the next person to host the show like every like every episode i i i imagine it to be like somebody hosting the oscars 
you know, yeah, every we time. The Oscars, we allow you to host us. <laughs> like, yeah, you know, yeah. So, Academy like, every... Award. So, so... <laughs> just goes to... So, so ah! every... So, every person who visits this podcast is doomed, basically. Because... <laughs> Uh, yeah, they are gonna have their work cut out for them because they have to come up with the segments themselves. <laughs> <laughs> it's like you do the work; we'll just listen. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, yeah. But anyways, know. um, Jay, what music do you produce or like write yeah. in music production oh, or songwriting? Uh, yes. I just do whatever's coming out of me. Uh, I don't write. Like when I write, I don't specifically write like music and oh, stuff yeah, like right, that. Yeah, uh, right. I just write whatever, but music lyrics sometimes do come out. And uh, yeah, and yeah. Any particular like... genres you produce or make? Um, used to do a lot of hip hop. Uh, oh, but yeah. Usually, just whatever. Actually, give me one second. I'm gonna try to see if I can pop out one of the things that I made recently. I'm really proud of the only thing that I've sort of mixed properly. All right. Ooh. Okay. Last thing I produced that was good to me was like when I had a fake rap career. What? <laughs> like, you know, like I did the whole like, you know, posting on Spotify and everything. Oh, yeah, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. But now nah, I'm just like, nah. I even, I even like, you know, it's funny. I actually got, I actually got my partner to like, you know, my missus to like, you know, rap on a track once. Oh, really? And I, I, I wrote I wrote the most dirtiest lyrics and it was on Spotify for like a bit and then like yeah. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Damn. Fellas Fellas. Jay, you still there? Yeah, he's still there, don't worry. Me? He's looking for the file. He's looking up the file. Yeah, I'm just, I'm trying to find this shit. It's super I don't what know where I can the most I like being organized yeah but i don't do it very well yeah so uh chat t- type down in the comments like you know what's your favorite yeah let's make a poll chat let's make a poll what, yeah what's 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 your favorite song what's your favorite genre jeez <laughs> don't be chat, a stranger chat <laughs> uh, chat type one in the chat if you think jim should be uh the 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 semi-permanent host of the show <laughs> semi-permanent host <laughs> One. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, majority. Well, well, majority well, rules. Neil, Neil, Neil. Uh, oh, oh fuck. Oh well. I hate. I hate doing this. <laughs> well, I've never hosted much. I think this is the first thing I've ever hosted in my life. <laughs> you know. Jeez. That's right, bro. I'll find this thing. It's I don't know. Like, should I sh- cut this out and be at it? Should I, like, well, like what? Like, you making this family friendly now? <laughs> Make this family friendly. Yeah, no cursing, by the way. No cursing, okay? Cursing, no yeah. cursing. No, no cursing. No cursing. So, like, do I, like, so, like, if I were to host, like, would, like, would it, would it be, like, in the most professional voice ever, or, like, or just my own voice? Like, I don't know. Where's the man? Like, would you like it if I sounded more serious or like more deeper, more intimate? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. What? Boston. Oh yeah, Jim. Did you hear my original song? Oh yes, I did, and I liked it. No, it was in, like Lost in Limbo. Yeah. Yeah. I was like, wow. What's emo rap? That song could actually oh, work. Not emo rap, emo act- pop. I mean, it's like Joji. Yeah, it is. Like, yeah. I was playing on ukulele as well. It just took me by surprise. It reminded me of Joji. So, um, so update on Jay. Like, how how's the file finding? How, file, file finders, file. bro. File finders. Terrible. You've got a file. We'll find it. You know, you know when you name a file like just like A S D F G H J K. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh my so, gosh, you're one of those guys. I used to do that. Well, I'm absolutely one of those guys. <laughs> oh, gosh. I need to find out which A S D F it is. If it's A S D F one, A S D F two, A S D F three. 
You know, I stopped typing. I just started like letting it name itself, like Project One, Project Two. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Name itself. Yeah, I stopped. Oh I stopped typing a long time ago. I stopped typing a long time ago. <laughs> yeah, you know, you know what, you know what I'm up to now. I'm up to like, I'm legit up to Project Thirty Eight. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh! That's how many tracks I've been making, like you know, and, Sheesh, and how do you on, keep up, on bro? Top, on top of that, like you know, I used to I had an old laptop and I deleted all my all my other music files. So like, you know, God only knows how many like songs I've actually made in my lifetime. <laughs> yeah, that's right. You know, I mean... yeah, Google Drive. Let me search the song that I have. Alex, did you find I it? I think I might be close. I might be close. Alright. Might might you might be. find the right ASDF. May have. I may have. No! Oh, wrong. Wrong one. Wrong one. Oh. Okay. Oh, okay. Where is that it? doesn't matter because we can try again. This is totally not going to be worth it. You guys are going to hear the most dog shit piece of music oh, you've ever that, heard in your life. And I'm just going to spend too. like 35 hours. Ah! Ah, I'll drop my I'll one. Try to do this as fast as I can. Trying to get. I'm gonna try to find oh, mine one too. Like my my best like work. Oh, best work. Oh, okay. You just battle with them like they're fucking Beyblades. Oh, oh please tell me. Oh, <laughs> I checked the wrong folder again. The wrong folder. Wait, what the? F Why am I? What? What happened? Hold on. Hold, Hold on. on a minute. It was in the... Yeah, I hate... Is... What do you hate? I hate OneDrive. OneDrive sucks. Why am yeah. I checking it? I don't use OneDrive. I don't use that bullshit. <laughs> uh, I might have it in Drive. I might ha Actually, I have it in my email. 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 I'd be using Google Drive. Google Drive. Google Drive. I have it in... What? You don't use it. Sounds like something I'd be I using Google you. Drive. The way you said it, Jim, something. sounds like something I Spice would say. Google Drive. Yeah, Google Drive. <laughs> you ain't got that Google Drive. What the shit? <laughs> Yo, why the fuck can I find it? I don't know. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> what happened? I'm still looking for that fire. Look at fire. Hello? Hello. Hello. Okay, Hello. Now, Hello. Now we now we turn to this segment, which was awkward silence. Hello. Yeah, the Hello. segment is Jay's a fucking dumbass who can't keep his shit together, so he's uh, spending the next five hours trying to figure out. Well, I found where he I found put my his files that he was proud of. <laughs> I I found my file, but like I'm kind of scared. Hey, like, Jim, this is yeah. my song with um Jay, the one he helped me with the lyrics. Yeah, let's go. Uh, you've probably you heard it already. Oh, it's not you sounding like a UK guy, right? Like no, doing no, no. drill rap. No, 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 no cursing. We said no cursing. We said no cursing. Okay. We said no cursing. Hey, hey, you're the one that's gonna be have to edit yourself out of this show. Yeah, yeah just don't even feature me on it. Just fucking, just silence all my parts. It'd probably be better for the edit because I'm not yapping for an hour about fucking Elden Ring. You know, if this, uh, like, if okay, if you weren't in this podcast, I'd say silent chase. Silent. Silent chase. <laughs> Uh, I what the fuck is happening? I uh, you know what I do? You know what just happened? What happened? All of my so I use I have like fifty Google Drive accounts. What? Damn, that's actually that, really, that actually that actually like that actually is like dope. The song, the broken yeah, broken from the start, broken my heart. I don't, I don't know what to say. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, Neil also Neil also has commitment issues featuring I Jay. Know, I to <laughs> featuring Jay. Or what do you mean I can't fucking update my password? What do you mean? <laughs> <laughs>
because of the grounds it's a ruins. I think you can get back up. You so let a computer tell you what to do? What will I manage? I never <laughs> 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 Why is it what all of my Google Drive accounts are showing the exact same music? No cursing. Exactly. No all my my <laughs> did I curse? Yes, you did. You said <laughs> Y'all wanna play Among Us? Among Us? Among Us. And he oh. suffered from Ligma. <laughs> oh my gosh. And the yeah, the guy smiles. Y'all I'm I'm Me saw who? Like Me saw who? Okay, I think we. I, I think I need to give up on the dream of showing you guys that because I'm. I i can not find it. Just save my. Just find your one, Jim. It seems that Neil came first. <laughs> <laughs> Is this a race now? <laughs> yeah, he did. He won. I. I lost. No, I mean, at least it's but Jay in the, in the feature. Uh, is a feature. Uh, this is this, this is the one I can safely say I'm proud of because I used to I used to actually give a crap about production, like the way I produce. Yeah, which one? Show me. But this was like you you already know this song. You already know this song. It's like 55 seconds. Oh, this one. This is from 2018, yeah. 19. Nah, I was like I was like 20. 21. Oh, so two years ago. I found it. Oh, I found it. Okay, yeah. this one has no lyrics. I just made it. Okay, so um, we're all gonna kind of play. So, with a machine gun. So, like, which part of the segment do we start listening to it? This is entirely, by the way, this was entirely done through MIDI, a MIDI keyboard. All of the instruments or MIDI yeah. keyboard. Uh, or okay. do not own a guitar or anything. So, uh, so Jay, you saw Neil's one? He's already heard uh, wait, No, no, I've been trying to look for this thing. Okay, so, um, let's have a reaction time. This is the segment. <laughs> I don't know how, how this is gonna work, the reactions. Alright, uh, y'all. I got it, y'all. Okay. Okay, let, wait, let me hear it. Broken from the start. Let me hear that shit. Broken nerves from the start's amazing. It's like hey, that beat. I've, I've heard that one before. Yeah, as per usual. That's Jim Wells one. Kind of sounds like Cardi. Oh, that's it. A Playboy Cardi. Ah. Oh. The broken from the start. No. Oh. Never mind. I like that beat. Yeah. Why is there a scream at the end? <laughs> oh, I, li I like that beat. I like the. It's funky. Mine uh, was not supposed to be a hip hop beat or oh. a, even a song beat, really. It was just supposed to be a song in and of itself that I made for a project. Ah. Oh. Uh, oh, yeah. I was working on besides that, so. ASDFFFF12. <laughs> 12? The 12th time. You... Nice. Real piano stuff, huh? Yeah. Damn. Well, real, it's a keyboard, but yeah. Damn. You need a lot. Of, you know how many plugins you need to make a keyboard sound like a fucking piano? <laughs> yeah, I imagine. Yeah. So like, what were you like? Are you going after like some anime type song? Or like, cause this this could sound like a like a part in an anime or something. Or like. sound like a ballad. Yeah, ballad. Or like, it could also sound like um, you know that musician Porter Robinson. Yeah. Yeah, he like he does a lot of piano stuff, right? Usually, the way I I work is I, 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 I transfer my mediums as I'm working through them. So if I'm writing something, I'm usually coming up with like a, a melody that yeah. I think goes along with the thoughts that I'm having for whatever I'm writing, Where, whether it be like a novel, a story or whatever. And then when I'm writing, when I'm making music, I'm thinking about something that I could write or that I've written. And that's kind of stringing me along to what I'm supposed to do, uh, you know? That's gonna kind of give me the vibe. Uh, that's pretty cool. 
I like your thought process or your creative process. MIDI guitar? You, you should be real proud of that one. That's, that was, yeah, really, that was good. really good, bro. I am proud of that. That was crazy. I remember when I... when I, That one took me a, a while. Though. It took me a while to... Because I just kept putting it off because I get, I couldn't sit down and just make the whole thing. I, I like did one thing. Then I was like, oh, this sucks. I went on, did something else, and then I came back and I was like, wait a minute, this doesn't suck that much. Came and did it. But I feel pretty proud of that one. Not bad. And yeah, to answer your question, Neil, uh, all of that was MIDI. So oh, all okay. of that was done through a keyboard, and then I used plugins and stuff to yeah. make it sound proper. It sounded like a guitar at one point. Was there a guitar used? Yeah. Yeah, MIDI there guitar. Was. Yeah, I know. What Which, software did you use? There was a no one. So there was some MIDI guitar, and then there was uh, an acoustic guitar that was turned to an electric guitar via plugins. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know what you mean. I, yeah. you, use, I, I you, use, you use Ableton or? FL Studio. Oh, F oh, wow. Okay. Well, you know when you look back at your stuff and you're just like, man, I was so aggressive back then? Yeah. Do, do, you, do you get, like, I, this is what, this is another song, but like, I have, but like, it was real aggressive. But for me, like, I was just like, what the heck's wrong with you? Like, why am I cussing so much? <laughs> Yeah, but this is what I made like back in 2021. If, uh, do you do you get it? Did you get it? Yeah, I got it. Wait. With the start of that beat, you already know it's gonna get aggressive. Sounds like something that the insane clown posse would use. Honestly, that one kind of sounds like insane clown posse. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I don't know what I was. I don't know what I was listening to back then, but yeah, like. <laughs> yeah. That are like some like like insane clown posse slash like limp biscuit type stuff. Oh yeah. Yeah, but, yeah, but that's the thing though. Like I don't know how to produce like that anymore. Like you know what I mean? Like I just I forget. Like I I will show you what I have like most recent like I don't know. But I f when I look at myself back then, I was like, man, I was in my prime. Mm. Like and then I was just like, oh, uh, this text. Are you still recording, Neil? Yeah, we're this still section recording. Of the podcast is just us. Occasionally going quiet. Yeah. <laughs> no, you can hear it. You can hear it. It's got desktop no. audio. Oh, does it? No, because like I'm playing the song as well while listening. Yeah. Know what I mean? Wait, let me look for another. Damn. I like this segment. It's like music sharing slash competition. Yeah. <laughs> Not really competition, no. But like composition music, thing. composition, yeah. Yeah, composition sharing, yeah. We should take um, all of these and then put them together into one package, and, and then name, that yeah, and name it. that. Sorry. Uh, name <laughs> what? Uh, and name the album New Zealand. <laughs> yeah. Because oh, that's the middle ground. Because that's, that's middle experience. earth, bro. That's where middle earth, <laughs> middle kingdom. That is where middle kingdom is, though. <laughs> that's where middle earth is, though, in New Zealand. <laughs> I know. We in the middle of the middle. The middle of the middle, bro. Yeah. But uh, yeah, like I don't know. Back then, like you know, like when I look at my tracks back then, I'm just like, who the heck possessed me? Yeah, that's all right. Beethoven. 
<laughs> Fuck. Did you say Did you just say Beethoven or Beethoven? Beethoven. Yeah. Beethoven, bro. Well. Oh, well. You said you had a missus. Ah, oh, yes. Straight Toven. Straight Toven. <laughs> We're close. Y'all know I haven't eaten anything all day. You haven't eaten anything? And I ate some fruit this morning, and that's about it. That's all right. At least you ate something. You sounded like jealous. <laughs> At least you ate something. <laughs> Sorry, man. My tone is so deaf. Neil, are you homeless secretly? Nah. Okay. <laughs> Which... I saw oh, there's, this, there's this really nice homeless man in Malibu. Yeah. Okay. He has a Twitter, I think, because he keep like, you know those signs they hold up? It's like, hey, I'm homeless, whatever. He has his Twitter right. tag there. Yep. Um, and he's he's nice. I would see him there, you know. And yeah. he said his birthday was two days ago or three days ago. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna I want to give him something. Yeah. So I went the day that same day, you know. Coincidentally, my brother went out to get some donuts, and he got like a dozen. And then the the lady at the shop just I guess she was just nice. Mm. She decided to just give him twice his order for free oh. um so i was like well we have a lot more donuts than i'm willing to eat so i was like well i could give some of these to that guy and i also bought him a cupcake and i also bought him like a nice cool drink right and yeah. i gave it to him and he was like no i'm good i was like but it's your birthday and he was like yeah but i'm good i was like my man what happened so i was just stuck with a bunch of stuff just thought wow. i'd let you guys know you know yeah that's right in case you guys, you know, were interested. Mm. So that, ladies bro. and gentlemen, that, 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 ladies and gentlemen, is why you should not judge a book by its cover. Exactly. So, yeah. Not all Australians thing, are bad. <laughs> yeah. This, <laughs> this, and this, and the segment, this segment is called Moral of the Story. Moral yeah. of the Story. One of the stories, some Australians can be normal people. <laughs> and you hear, that, you, you hear that, folks? This is coming from an American. Listen. Listen <laughs> here. Leave it funny. What? What? No, I'm playing the what? music while you guys are <laughs> talking aggressively. <laughs> what? Yeah. what? Whoa, whoa, whoa. I didn't say anything wrong, bro. <laughs> You accusing me? <laughs> Everyone, should... yo, chat, chat, chat. Yeah, put Jim is throughout this whole podcast and make him look bad. It's just even funnier when you watch it again, cause like, when you watch it again, right on the the video, you can hear the music, like Jay's music being played, and it's like you got to take it seriously. <laughs> Speaking oh, of Lord. looking at things, like I was looking at the old, I was uh. Give him the old podcast episodes a little watch. Oh, yeah? Bro, holy shit. Some of those were funny as hell, just because what the fuck was I talking about half the time? <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. I was listening to him with my girlfriend. I was like, at one point, I said some bullshit. She started laughing at me. I was like, what happened? She was like, man, you're acting like you, you got fucking fans. I'm like, bro. <laughs> you don't even know. The Neil and Jay podcast community is strong. Yeah. Jim, it's strong. Uh huh. Now, Jim, don't be surprised if you see a couple of paparazzi outside of your house. <laughs> oh my gosh. 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 I'm famous now. <laughs> I'm so oh my sorry. gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Shut up. Shut the fuck up. Door. Shut the front door! <laughs> and this this segment is called Random Noises. Dun, 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 dun. I said this. We should use this. We should use this as the theme song, Jay. So Jay, 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 what is your what is your random noise of the day? Jay, use your song uh, as your theme song, bro. Send me the song. Come on, random noise. Random. Uh, 
<laughs> okay. And Neil, what is your random noise of the day? <laughs> what? Was that, it? was that it? Was that it? Yeah, yeah, was it? Um, hey Jay, is it if I download your song? Because it's a good theme song. And there sure, you have it, folks. Yeah. There you have it, folks. That that was the random noise of the day. What's the name of the song? Like, what would you call it? Uh, the name of the song is A S A A S D F F F twelve. Oh, okay. I'll just put J at the end by J. A A S D F F F twelve by J. That's a good song, bro. I'm playing it right now while you guys are talking. I'll put it down. It's a good theme song, bro. Seriously, if you listen to it, it's a good theme song. Also, I had a lot of Persona in the head while uh, I was no, no way. Persona! 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 Looking cool, Joker. Fuck. So, um... Yeah, um... I don't... No, okay. So this, much... this episode has been interesting. Yeah. And uh, all over yeah. the fucking place. Interesting. It is. I, I, I don't know. Like, is it dying or is it surviving? I, I can't tell. I don't it. think it's been alive. But oh. It's been dead the whole time? It's no. been dead the whole time. Damn, son. Where'd you get this? Sorry. Well, fellas. I think with that music segment. Yeah. I think we should each give a closing speech, a motivational yeah. speech yeah. for the audience okay. of okay. Millie that we have listening. Um, can we stay in this call after we stop recording? Yeah, sure. Yeah. Okay. So um, there you have it, folks. The closing speech. This is the last segment and probably the very last like you ever see of this segment <laughs> or of this podcast we might give up after this one <laughs> probably yeah we might because yeah. our our all of our d ideas are, are just all over the place and we have no formula <laughs> and we are um, how much do you want to bet i will bet a, a, a fucking my life on it how much do you want to bet every other episode is going to devolve into the same things of me talking about elden ring at some point yeah um talking about ancient aliens at some point yeah talking yep. about how this show is it has no fucking form or factor <laughs> and then <laughs> every episode that could also and, be the thing you know it's a podcast and, where every episode is the same thing it's like kind of like a yeah. dementia yeah. podcast dementia podcast or, or insanity if you like yeah. um <laughs> yeah i just imagine yeah, yeah. Feel a little more detached from reality yeah I just, I just imagine the segments to be exactly the same as they were, and you share the exact same song every segment. Yeah, <laughs> I will. <laughs> and, you know, and, we, and, we, even, and we have guests. We have every guest that we get. We need to tell them yeah. in advance. Hey, you need to bring a song for the show and tell. Yeah, <laughs> show or and tell. Need, yeah, you should. Or, and, or, or you, you go or, or a video, and, or a song, or video that you'd like yeah. to share. Or, or you everyone's gonna show Jim's song as their own. Yeah. You go up to you go up to these guests and you tell them to act like Jim, but they don't know who I am. Yeah, it's like, hey, you have to listen. We we need you to be Jim. Got it. You need a you need a host. <laughs> yes. Yeah, you need to host. Um. Speak about your missus every once in a while. Yeah. And, and uh, uh, show us aggressive tracks. Yeah, and have a funny little accent. <laughs> to be fair. I Everyone be... in the guest list that uh, I've provided, uh, Neil. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, they're all southern, so they all have funny accents. Oh, okay. Oh, so that's cool. Hey, that's all right. I've always wanted to mimic their accent. In a way, you know, <laughs> you know are, like southern. You know, what would be so funny. You know, what would be so, so funny is that every guest is Filipino. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> <laughs> it's just, it just, no, it just don't never do that. <laughs> You just, you just never, ch you never changed the race. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think that's possible, like, bro. 
And, there, and there's no diversity. The there's no diversity in this show. Like it's just <laughs> the whole point of the podcast for this frail little Hispanic man to learn about Filipino culture slowly. <laughs> I just I love Filipino culture. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. yeah but, uh, y'all got like, uh, y'all got like, um, hmm? y'all got like, um, you know, y'all got like, uh, and yeah. guys, that was, that was the ending. Alright, you got the, uh, you, you got, you got, uh, that's the end. <laughs> Alright, should we start over there? Yeah, we should. Um, All well, right. guys, well, ladies and gentlemen, it's been an honor being here on this podcast. It's been an honor hosting this damn podcast. And I hope that you guys take nothing from this podcast and go about your day. And um, we will see you or Neil featuring Jay. I mean, Jay featuring. I can't tell anymore. <laughs> I hope I hope that these two will see you in the next future. Depending and on, depending on the lifespan of this podcast. Real quick, y'all can follow me at Arsmimika on Twitter and Arsmimika on Instagram and Arsmimika on Discord as well. Uh, y'all can reach me on Snapchat somehow. I don't know how. Uh, Facebook Arsmimika as well. Uh, yeah. I also type out my email in the description if you guys want to hit me up there. Uh, and I will put a GoFundMe to uh, buy myself a. New Mansion. Zealand. In the, yeah, I will buy New Zealand. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. You will, you will you, buy you New will Zealand. Buy, you, no, no, no. You will buy one of New Zealand. You will be, yeah, you will buy one, one. New Zealand. Yes, <laughs> one New Zealand. You will buy one. And, um, guys, if you ever want to reach out to me, um... Don't. Don't. <laughs> or, or do, or do, you can. It's just my name. You and then... On the social medias, and then I'll probably um, Neil can probably you know with his tech whiz can type that on the description of how to get a hold of me. Not that you have hands to hold me. Um, <laughs> and, then, and Neil, what is your what is your credentials? What is your number? Uh, no credentials. <laughs> yeah, let's all share our phone numbers and our uh, bank account security. Numbers. Yeah, security. social security, <laughs> social security <laughs> number. Social security. I'll share my text and number. Our... <laughs> It'll be showing yeah, on yeah. the screen here right now, as you can see. <laughs> Anyways, I think that's it, folks. Oh, and chat, chat, don't forget to share your cur- cursor credential. <laughs> that's a fr- <laughs> Thanks for sure. watching. Yeah, chat, chat, put all of your information down. Yeah. Chat, chat. Anyway, anyways, chat, chat. I don't know. This is taking forever. We don't know how to say goodbye. We just don't know how to say goodbye. Just don't okay? say goodbye. <laughs> we're not. We're never gonna say. We're not gonna say goodbye. Okay. Like, we're never gonna say goodbye. Twenty-four-seven live. Neil, 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 Neil. I'm Neil. I'm talking to you. I just come up with an idea. Yeah. What is it? Yeah. Listen. We make end of the podcast, and you come up with one idea. <laughs> yeah, listen, 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 listen. Okay. It is a live podcast. Okay. Okay. 24-7. Okay. And it's just anyone like we create look, look, we get all the guests that we possibly can. We create can we get paid while sleeping. <laughs> yes. Yes. Okay. But listen, we take all the guests that we can possibly think of. We put them on a server and okay. we like they all rotate in the call yeah. and stuff like that whenever they feel like it and that though it's a, an infinite podcast and then people can donate a certain amount of money to be added into the the server so they can be in the rotation as well oh okay oh. y'all don't see the vision i do see the vision i know i know exactly what you're going for you're going for mcdonald's well, like a rotation. Back. <laughs> it's, sure. like, it's like what 24 hour mean? 24 hour service, different shifts, you know, shift, shift, like, you know, like people be taking it on shifts. <laughs> Let me do a quick Google search, okay? Quick Google search. Uh, yep. Quick end of the episode Google search. Yo, what's uh, up? What I mean is. McDonald's is valued at. Uh... What? 
180 billion dollars so i think becoming mcdonald's is not necessarily a bad thing you know it's not a bad thing but we're just podcasts we we're just... nearly there folks <laughs> we, could be, we could be the mcdonald's of podcasts we're nearly there uh, can we just say bye now like uh, bye <laughs> okay bye guys but i mean bye the chat because we're hey, gonna chat, stay hey, chat, hey chat put what? one in the chat <laughs> oh my god you... no, Neil, 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 end it Neil, end it now end, 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 end. we should not end this episode Neil, end the episode uh, give it give it five Neil, minutes give it five minutes like, i'll end it chat. okay five minutes five minutes okay when do you reaches... have anything to say do you guys have anything to say within the five minutes it's gonna be two Speak hours. Now. The the podcast will be two hours once I when I, I stop it. Speak now or forever hold your peace. <laughs> um, you have any I ideas? Have a long winded conversation about oh, okay. the ever changing political okay. landscape of Japan. Oh, okay. Okay. I like where this is going. Why Japan though? Why are you talking about? This is only big in Japan. Y'all, y'all don't think like my, uh, my 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 podcast idea ain't bad. Look, we have a rotating guest of people. Not only that, but we have like a like a like a, like a like a we have like activity. So it's not like we're just talking. Sometimes we're like playing uh, Among Us, or sometimes we're playing Elden Ring, or sometimes we're playing fucking Overwatch or MMOs or whatever, you know. And like and like people just join in and shit like that. And we have like a twenty four hour podcast, and we're basically living in the podcast everything we do has to be in the podcast if you if you want to take a shower it has to be on the, the podcast if you want to uh if you want to uh jay 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 take jay. your missus out on a date it has to jay. be on the podcast if jay you... jay jay i admire your your passion towards this project but i think we we admire like we we love our privacy you know <laughs> We also have our own thing. We have our privacy. private life is an unsuccessful one. Huh. Like, no, like you already you already sent the paparazzi to, to my house, so yeah. like I can't even. Exactly. So what's the difference, really, right? But I don't want to. Heck, they're just taking photos of me. But like, I don't want to. I want people to hear me. You know. Yep. Sometimes well, you are allowed to mute yourself every now and then, but if you do it for more than ten minutes at a time, uh. You have to forfeit something of great value to you. Oh, I just I just muted myself. <laughs> what? Three well, minutes. I don't appreciate that. Oh yeah, there's three, two, three or two minutes left. Three minutes. Oh, three minutes. Why are you such a rush to end this episode? I think I thought I thought we were having fun. No, we are having fun. I want to stay. I want to stay on this call and end the podcast, so we can now live okay, our life. I think we should leave the podcast uh, going for. I don't know. When do you guys go to sleep? <laughs> Bro, minutes. Is... Two, two minutes. <laughs> Almost two minutes. Wait, it's not two minutes yet. Yeah, that's when we go to sleep. So, chat. Type two in the chat if you guys want the 24 hour long podcast. 24 7. Type one in the chat if you mean two. Type any number, letter, and or emoticon if you think that we should keep this going. And do not type if you meant to type. <laughs> chat. What? Chat, I don't know. chat, chat, chat. Just go nuts. <laughs> oh no, it finished. Y'all don't mess with that idea though? Shit, you know what? Then I'm, no, I'm, I'm, oh, I'm, I'm, rebelling. I'm, I'm breaking free. I'll make my own podcast. No, don't. Okay. We'll miss Where you. It's, it's me, me sitting in a public call, and then whoever wants to join gets Jay, to join in. Jay, Jay, Jay. We all know that if you were to leave us, you're just gonna make another podcast, and it's still gonna feature Neil. <laughs> <laughs> and he will be part of the. Uh, Infinite rotation. If you <laughs> one minute you're left. More than I somehow, somehow, it's still gonna feature Neil. Like somehow. Yeah, I live in his shadow. I can't, I can't <laughs> escape him. <laughs> <laughs> yes. yes. So whatever you do, no matter how much you run away, no matter what we do, Neil arrives.
Okay, fine. We'll do one last. We'll do one last segment, and this is gonna be the most cringiest segment. No, no. What is? We've only got thirty seconds left. What is your? Thirty seconds. You you have thirty seconds. You have thirty seconds to show me your anime voice. If you have one. Neil, end it. End it. End it. End it. (laughs) Wait, ten seconds. Ten. Nine, seven, eight, six, five, three, two. You said it. You said it, guys. That is. I'm gonna end it. Okay, bye.